Mmm, something's fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shagzan, and in today's video, we'll be talking about an advanced guide on what runes to take with Fizz, AP, in the mid lane. I will be covering everything on what runes to take specifically in situations and all possible runes you want to take in general. Alright, so right now on screen, I have the most recommended rune page for Fizz because it provides exactly what you need like burst and a bit of healing. This rune page gives you the most power and lets you deal the most damage, especially in the early game. You will see most Fizz players take this page every game because it gives you the most results, but let's talk about some variations you can make to this rune page. So right now on screen, I have the second most taken rune page on Fizz, which I like to call the safe page. The only difference to this rune page is that the resolve tree is in the secondary. The reason why you would want to take resolve in the secondary tree is because you are either going against a counter pick or you want to play safe during the laning phase. I strongly recommend you don't take this page every game because you need to snowball as Fizz and the more offense you have, the better. The reason why I personally take this rune page is against really really tough matchups for Fizz, like Lissandra or Pantheon. The main thing you want to take every game is Electrocute because it gives you a bunch of extra damage and helps you complete your one shot combo. So now our third and basically last rune page for Fizz is the inspiration in the secondary. To be honest, I personally never take this page after the nerf's done to time more tonic and how long it takes to get your magical footwear. Me as a Fizz main, I prioritize damage from Cope de Grace and HP gain from Triumph in close duels. This page can work for you and honestly it comes down to preference and what the player actually wants. The only reason why I would ever take this page is because of time work tonic and tough matchups but honestly the resolve tree helps you more. These three pages I've talked about all give you burst with electrocute but what the option really comes down to is which do you want more damage, defense, or utility, and you will have to make that answer yourself with each game you play and situation. My last fun rune page you maybe want to try is going to be the unsealed spellbook rune page. Never try this in ranked, please, but this is just an off meta thing to do for fun in normal games. What this rune page provides is a lot of utility and creative plays you can do with the unsealed spellbook itself. It lacks burst damage which is key on Fizz AP Assassin but you are able to switch your summoner spells every couple of minutes which is a fun thing to try and do. Anyways guys I really hope you enjoyed that video and if you did please smash the like button because it would really help me out a lot. Comment what you want to see next and subscribe to see more like this in the future. I'm Sharkzone here with another video and I'm out. Peace. Yeah.